On the other side of Badagri town and perched by the lagoon is the fishing community of Afowo. Here, the dominant egun speaking folks also have cause to be grateful to the appeals project. Gaining access to the waterfront, which used to be a Herculean time-consuming venture, is now like shooting fish in a barrel. Thanks to a 0.275 km thoroughfare constructed as a farm access road under the infrastructure support component of the appeals project to agribusiness clusters. A fully constructed jetty links the newly constructed road to the lagoon, which is the business site for a cottage fish production unit, registered as the AFOA cluster under the project. This is AFOA community. Wow, this place is looking so beautiful. Well, thanks to the intervention of appeals. Formerly, this place is inaccessible, like for farmers, for vehicles and even for the fishmongers but thank god today it's beautiful you can see how beautiful the place is so lovely now let's go on the water ekaro 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 gogoleo how far are you doing now i'm fine boss <laughs> ekaro yeah. sir Alpha. yes so okay welcome to our uh, community what we're doing at the moment is um, we're trying to mend our nets in preparation for the next um, uh, stocking season We've had a very wonderful um, season this year and um, after every, after very wonderful, very wonderful um, and after every season we have to rehabilitate like we do in Ethan Pond but these ones we have to mend our nets in preparation for the next stocking so that's what we going going at this, um, at this moment. Just a few years back the story was different for fish farmers in a FOA community. Those were the days of earthen ponds and persistent physical exhaustion. The introduction of the cage culture and subsequent demonstration by the Appeals Project was the game changer and a successful depiction of technology transfer. For the Appeals Project, we have 60, 60 cages that's of 1,500 capacity. And the other side too, we have about 120 cages too from the Ministry of Agri, aside from the appeals cages. And we, over there too, we have, um, I think we have about five private investors too. It is a rather complex network of interwoven cages formed with nets as walls and submerged in the lagoon while supported with plastic containers for buoyancy. The cage culture technology is described as nutrition friendly climate smart and adaptable for especially rearing tilapia. The, but the only challenge with the cage culture is the initial capital, which is most expensive and that's what appeals took care of. Uh, the project took care of the structures and everything. But the way it is now, all the farmer requires is just to get the fish, stock the cages and you feed. And once it's time for harvest, then shorter period of harvest too. Normally in ethane ponds, before you achieve such cage, uh, sizes, maybe you'll be looking at six, seven, eight months. But with the cage culture, four, five months. So shorter period of, uh, for harvest. With 200 cages in play arising from expansion, harvesting between every three and five months obviously means increased activities for farmers in the Afowo cluster. A lot of value chain too has yeah. sprung up from this. We have a lot of people even within the community, within the clusters that are marketers as well too. They come from mm. Bene, they come from Agbara, they come from Abalata, from Apapa, 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 Lagos, Ugora, here and there. Yeah. So on that day it's always stressful. We sell for like two, for like I think four or five days. So it's not all the day. We, we, when we sell this week, maybe in the next one week we have another sale. With increased productivity and the opportunity of a ready market, which derives from commercial partnerships with off-takers, an arrangement put in place by the Appeals Project, the Afoa fish farmers say they are currently in a happy place. Appeals has done so much for us and this is really wonderful. We appreciate them. Their intervention was really awesome. We want to say thank you to Appeals. We appreciate you and thank you for your trainings as well it has added so much value to us 
Yeah, interestingly, Appeals intervention came up when a lot of farmers were challenged post-COVID and um, it has really changed the stories of a lot of people that were giving up already in our culture. And the way it is now from the success of this project, um, it shows there's a lot of hope for us. Yeah. It's changed life. It's magnificent. It's a game changer. Thank you very much, Appeals. Appeals!